Okay, I'm going to show you how to work through my Weebly now that it's been updated. So I am at the Henry Jaisa website, which you can get to directly or from Pemna Trails. You're going to click on the three bars here and you're going to go down to contact us and click on contact us. And then you're going to click those three bars again and go to staff contact information and scroll down until you find my name and click on it and that should take you directly to my Weebly. So here it is and the very first page is an update, an updated message for you and your parents. Now this is being done on my phone. If you're going to do it on your computer, on the top part, right under Miss Matthews, kind of where I'm highlighting here, is where you will find the tabs. And the tabs are entitled Home, which is where we are right now, Reading, Books, Writing, and Social Studies. But for now, those are in those three lines in the top left-hand corner. So this is the information for you, the home page. It says how I will be available to talk to you via email. Uh, that for there's my email address then there's the hello message which is a video that I just recorded for you with some information and then it says click here to hear me explain how to navigate the new tabs that's what I'm recording now so it doesn't show up here but hopefully when you're watching this it's up there so if you scroll down a bit it gives you what I would like you to do this week so you would click on the reading tab which I'll show you in a second and we are doing a reading as rad. This is your final reading as rad. This is the term three reading as rad. Uh, so you can read your book and begin to work on that um, if you wish. You know how reading as rad goes. You have the month to do it and you can work at it at your own pace. So the same applies here. And then I will be posting some New York Times assignments uh, as well. So why don't we go to those right now? So you're gonna click on the reading tab and it will take you here. Now, the first assignment is the New York Times article and I'm going to let you read that. Um, there is a link and I'll click on that in a minute, but here are the instructions. So you click on it and the first thing is under the questions for writing and discussions, click the link that says read the article. So we're gonna click that link and we are going to Scroll down a bit so we had to bypass some of this stuff. This is not uh, the article. So you scroll down here and you click read the article. And the questions that you see, one, two, three, four, five, six, those are the questions that you're going to answer. So click on read the article. This is the actual article. Once you read it, you're going to go back with your back arrow and, oops, read the article, once you're done reading it, hit your back arrow, and that will get you back to the questions. So again, this is kind of annoying, but you're gonna to have to click back there, scroll down. This is what you want, questions for writing and discussions. So now that you've read the article, you go back and you answer the questions. You can, I would like you to open up a, um, a folder in uh, OneDrive and answer the questions one to six for this. So you'll save it as New York Times one and you can call it, um, yeah, this is New York Times one. You, that's what you can call the folder. And on the Word document that you're typing, you're going to write the title of the article and then you are going to have your name. So when I print these off or when I'm looking at them, I know who it is. Now. Um, the New York Times one is number one to you. I'm going to post four of these. You only have to do two of them. And everything that I'm telling you is all on my Weebly. So I'm actually going to see if I can get out of this and go back to the reading. So again, I'm doing it on my phone. It'll look a little bit different on your computer. You're going to have to scroll around a bit, but if you take your time to look through things, you'll find it. Um, so you answer the questions. Everything you need to know about the New York Times article is on this page. 
you're going to answer the questions one to six and then you're going to add at the bottom um, I thought this article was blank because and then make sure you have a period the most interesting thing about this that I learned was or the most important thing that I learned was period um, if you are interested in that article or anything else you see there feel free to look around and read some stuff and then when you save that art, uh, article you can read it over make sure it's your good copy save it and you can share it with me when you get it finished or you can share it with me on Friday so that parts up to you if I scroll down again you'll see number two there is your reading is rad everything is normal you click on it and it should take you directly to the assignment so that should all look familiar to you now you may wonder how are you supposed to answer this on here it looks weird because it's my phone don't worry you can print this out if you don't have it and bring it back with you if you don't have a printer you can save this um, to your OneDrive however you can do that copy and paste or just save it as a new document and um, print it out you can type it directly on your word document or you can just look at the questions and answer it on loose leaf it doesn't really matter the format that you get it back to me as long as you get this done so whatever works for you I know some of you like to type this so you can type it if you want I'll save another lesson for going over how to do this especially the connections page so don't worry about that um, until Monday maybe on Tuesday that'll be my message to you and then three I just wrote um, something to do for fun if you feel like doing some reading what I'd really love you to do is read something maybe that you don't normally read or get that library card out and download some books audio or, or otherwise on Libby but that's just an option okay now I'm going to go back to the writing tab so um, this week March 23rd, sorry, starting Monday, March 23rd to 27th, I would also like you to complete two writing prompts. So again, I'm going to go to the writing tab, and um, I'm going to post one every day, but you only have to do two of them. And same goes, you can type it out, or you can um, handwrite it and send it to me. Uh, but I would like them on Friday. You can always take a picture of it and send it to me, scan it and send it to me, or you might just find it easiest to type it on OneDrive. So your Monday question is right there. As always, you can answer one or more or both, but 10 to 15 minutes of uninterrupted thinking and writing is what I'm looking for. So do you have to hand this in? Yes, you do. If you just want to write it out with a pen or pencil on paper, that's fine, but you have to save them so you can hand them in to me when we return to school. So make sure you take good care of all this work that you're doing. The last thing I'm going to show you today is social studies. And if you look at that, there's no social studies yet. Check back later this week. So um, again, stay tuned to the Weebly. Wednesday or Thursday, there will be a little social studies activity. It will be very low key for you to work on. The last thing I want to tell you is if this is too much or it's becoming stressful and you're not sure how to get it done you're not back at school for three weeks so if you have to take a little bit more time for something because you're struggling to get it done that's fine but you just have to let me know if there's anything else please email me sorry this was so long the next one won't be as long but I just want to make sure you're comfortable using the Weebly because I'm not going to be emailing you. This is going to be where all your information is going to be coming until at least the 13th. And if things change after then, I will for sure let you know. I hope you have had a good week at home and that on Monday you're ready to start doing some schoolwork. I'll talk to you soon.